y'all. So, um, for this video, you're going to need some lighters. And don't mind me, I sound sick. I am stuffed up. And don't mind my Digi shirt. I've been working today, so I'm in my little, you know what I'm saying, like an old shirt that has stains on it. I was doing cups and stuff earlier, and I don't like getting resin on my nice clothes, you know. And down by the background, so it's, it's 30 in here, okay? But anyways, you're going to need some lighters. It don't matter what color they are. I prefer Bic because, I don't know, I just think they're like a nice quality lighter. I don't know why, I just do. Um, I mean, if you can go the cheaper way and go to Dollar Tree, get like the really cheap ones for a dollar each, I mean, you're profiting off it. So, I mean, whichever way you want to do it. Um, so, yeah, pretty much I'm just going to, you need some lighters. I'm going to show in the, um, in the next clip how I clean these off. I pretty much just take the, like, the um, sticker off and I wipe it down with some alcohol. I mean, you don't need this. I just want to do it just so, like, the stickers adhere to it really good. You know what I'm saying? So, um, I got some of this. I've been like really, really working on how to seal these. So I'm going to try this next. I feel like this would be the best thing because I have transfer tape back here that I was putting on them just to like seal them, you know, so they're not like getting like wet or anything. Even though the paper that I use, I will show you the paper as well. The paper that I use, the sticker paper that I use is very, very good quality. It is matte, so it's not like a glossy look, but it's very good quality and it barely smears. But I still feel like it needs something protective over it. So I bought this and I feel like this will work so good because it's such a, like a thin material. I feel like it won't like pop up where like this is so thick. It was so heavy weighing on it, it like would pop it up, if that makes sense. But let me show you the sticker paper that I have. One second. All right, y'all, this is the sticker paper that I use. Um, I love this sticker paper. I have glossy paper right here which is kind of like the same, like, I don't know. I just, I've never used it. It says it's water resistant, but I've tried these like twice and they smear every time. I'm like, I just don't even want to mess with that, ruin my ink and just deal with it. I think that's just another day if I have time, I'll mess with it. But if y'all use that and y'all can get it to not be waterproof, please let me know how, like seriously, like I really want to know because I don't know how to do it. But yes, this is the paper I use, the sticker paper, it's matte. Man, I mean, it's still like really, really, you'll notice when I print it how good of a quality it is. But um, I just know for sure it's like water resistant. It won't smear on me and stuff like that. Like I use these for products. I'll put a little picture up here, what I use them for. And they turn out really, really good. They're really pretty. And like, I love them. When I used to sell cosmetics, I used them. But yeah, guys, so that's what you need for this video. Um, hopefully I'm not talking too much because you know, your girl likes to talk. I am a talker. So skip through this video if you don't want to hear me talk. <laughs> But um, yeah, that's what you need. And then I'm gonna be showing you how I like, what size I make these. I will put in the description box so everybody knows so you don't have to like look through like the video or the comments or anything. I'll put in the description box what, ow, I threw that at myself. What size I make the stickers because I always have the trouble finding what size to make it and like who wants to measure a lighter and you know, so I'll help you out there. But um, yeah, let's get into this video. tissue or cotton ball or whatever. I don't know where my cotton balls are, so I'm using this. And I'm just gonna go in and wipe down all of these lighters. At least try and get some of this residue off. And plus, I feel like the sticker paper will adhere so much better to like a really, really clean surface. And yeah, so I'm just gonna wipe down the whole lighter with this.
pictures off word just like make the pictures a certain height and length and then you could just cut the pictures yourself you do not need to have a cricket i just want to put that out there because i know a lot of people don't have a cricket and they're like really there's only a tutorial for a cricket yes you do not need a cricket for this but anyways i'm going to set my square box here to i believe 2.6 by 2.7 i will put the everything in the description box as well but um yeah that's how big i'm gonna make it and then i'm gonna place it over my picture select the whole picture and the box and i'm gonna slice it and that's how it's going to be on the lighter and then right here i'm just getting my pictures ready to go and they're going to be printed I love it. It always, they never disappoint me. This paper is awesome. I don't know. I get it from Amazon. If anybody's wondering, I get it from Amazon. I always make videos using this paper. So if you don't see me this one, you're going to see me another video using these. So, um, yeah, so I just want to show you the quality. Like, this is it fresh out of the printer. I love it. And my printer probably needs ink as well. So, like, look at that. It still looks awesome. So, what I'm going to do is let me find my other paper this right here i'm gonna take this right here this is new to me too you guys so please bear with me i'm gonna cut off a little bit because i did already peel some off to see how thin it was and i just don't want to mess up any of these lighters all right so what i'm gonna do which I like this type of paper because then I can measure and be like, oh, that's gonna fit perfect. Like, look at it, I already messed up this one. I just wanna have a straight edge. It's a semi-straight edge. All right, so what I'm gonna do is kind of line it up here and see how much I need to cut. So I can probably cut it here. Okay. You cut it here and then cut it here. Perfect. Beautiful. So I'm going to cut that just like so.
and I'm gonna set it as sticker paper more just so it cuts through the um adhesive or I mean the lamination part of this and we'll hit the little Cricut button and we'll go from there right here since I am using a Cricut I'm going to select the material as sticker paper and as more so then therefore when it cuts it's going to be you know push really hard down so it cuts through that like sticker paper okay so once i did that it's gonna give me the blinking light i'm gonna hit the cricket button it's gonna read it like so so my my dirty cricket it looks trash i clean it and clean and clean it and it somehow it gets dirty Like right now it's just reading the lines that's why it's very important to cover them because it bases off of that black line right there and bam yep i'll show you when it starts cutting. all right so i might do a few redo a few of these just because i didn't cut the um this piece out like too far over for these ones so I'm just gonna show you like a few of the good ones and then if I fix them, I'll take a video of them. It's all right, I'm just going to take this off of here. Just like so. That's why I cut it as more, so it kind of just comes off by itself. So once I do that, I'm going to take my lighter. I'm kind of nervous, you guys. Yes, this is wiped off. This might just be like the marking from the alcohol. I'm going to take this off. I'm gonna try and put it in the middle as perfect as I can. So don't mind me if you see my head in here. I'm just trying to line it up as best as I can. I'm just gonna kind of do that. Rub it in really good like that. And then I'm gonna fold one side over. I'm gonna kind of do it as I'm moving so it doesn't put any bubbles in there, which that isn't too hard to do. So bam, and then I'm gonna do the other side. Just make sure this is really adhered. Rub it in, you can even use this. It doesn't hurt. And then I'm gonna rub this side in. Just like so. All right. I think that worked very, very well. I think this paper works so much better than the other one. And bam. This is the seal of it, so as you can see, it actually is very, very sealed. Like, compared to the other stuff I've ever done, I am very impressed. I think this is how I'm gonna do them from now on. So yes, I highly recommend this paper. This is like the best one I've used so far. It actually like feels really good, and it's not too thick where it's lifting it up or anything. I like it, y'all. All right, let's do some. I'm on my last two. I had a whole bunch to make, but oh my god, this shirt looks so dirty, but really, it's just one of them shirts, like I said before. But um yeah, I'm on my last two. Okay, that right here. Um, I had a whole bunch, but a lot of them are like nude, you know what I'm saying? And I did not want to show that. Of course, just out of my customers' privacy and for YouTube cause you know, cause YouTube, um, of course you don't want to put it on YouTube, but yeah, I'm just putting this on here like so, like I showed you, and I really, really, really think, like, that quality with this stuff right here is so much better than what I ever used before, and I totally recommend it. I got it from Walmart, I believe it was like $4, even if that. I don't know, I sent my boyfriend to do it. Cause he, I usually send my boyfriend to do all my errands. Like my craft errands while I'm at work. But um, yeah, so I really, really like this. See, the only thing is like when people send you images, make sure you tell them that the image is really on the front. Like, look at that. I don't know, see, I might send this to her and be like, hey, I just wanna let you know. It don't really look, you know what I'm saying? like totally a brat but yes this is some of them right here this girl's face it was really close up picture so 
but this was really cute new trend maybe um it's like a girl's mirror picture that's cute some doggies that's cute um this girl's face pictures i did a double face like i made this clutch just so they fit really well on the um thingy but like these um ones with like nudes let me tell you they're cute this one's kind of like that but not really she put this on facebook before so like i think it's okay to post but like look at that okay just like your boo finna be smoking with this real cute yeah guys i just um i hope you enjoyed this video i hope it helped you i did put the measurements in my description box everything i used in the description box as well um the measurement again is 2.6 inches in width 2.7 inches in height so um i'll definitely put that in the description box but yeah guys i hope you enjoyed this video i hope you um sell these or you know make them for yourself i hope you enjoy them i hope they bring you a lot of um fun or money or whatever whichever cause you're using them for but yeah guys i hope y'all have a great day great night whatever it is for you but um yeah if you've not subscribed already please 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 subscribe because your girl wants to get to like 10k by the end of the year because i really really, really want you know get this going i really want to start showing like more of like my business stuff i actually am getting like my office together and everything i actually might be moving so that might be fun i might vlog all that and everything so um yeah y'all um thanks for watching and this is how one of my set of lighters went and yeah they look beautiful and i hope you enjoyed this video please don't forget to subscribe and again thanks for watching